Hey guys, welcome back to Web3 Money. Uh, we will be doing an NFT review, uh, Pixels Farmland. Uh, so I wrote a comprehensive article about the background, unique value team uh, in my newsletter or web3money.co website. Uh, so why don't we go ahead and just get into it. So Pixels is a blockchain-based farming game that allows players to own virtual land plots as NFTs. Uh, you guys have probably heard of the Central Land or the Sandbox. Uh, this is a very familiar NFT type of uh, initiative. The game launched in January 2022 with 5,000 unique farmlands NFTs on the Ethereum blockchains. Players can farm resources on their land, craft items, and participate in the in-game economy. Um, unique value prop pixel. Pixels aims to bring the classic frame farming game experience to the metaverse. The farmland NFTs provide true ownership of in-game assets that can be bought, sold, and rented. Owning land allows player to earn resources passively. The game also integrates popular NFT avatar collections like Bored Apes and Azuki, allowing holders to use their NFTs as in-game characters. This is really cool and very different. I did not think that this could happen. This creates additional utility engagement for blue chip NFTs if you guys are holding them or if you want to hold them in the future. I think this is something that we're going to see very much so in the next couple of years as well, globally, I mean. So the Pixels teams include co-founders of the popular Facebook game GameHouse, which had millions of players, as well as developers from major gaming studios like Ubisoft. So they, these clearly are veterans. They know what they're talking about. They are in the industry for a long time, and uh, they're able to create these experiences. Uh, this experience team is well positioned to build an immersive and an addictive Web3 farming game, if you want to go ahead and call it that. Uh, Pixels Online, so Pixel broke the record today of active players all at once. So 82,000 players, I saw this on Twitter, um, they released this on March 6th, so exactly six days ago, about a week ago. 82,000 players playing the game at the same time. They took, uh, they took a screenshot, posted on Twitter, or, or X rather. A daily active users is measured by 24 hours, obviously. All at once is another type of metric. Uh, this is a nice screenshot of, uh, of this. I think this, honestly, this itself should be should be an nft uh i just wrote that randomly okay cool so that's uh that's a little bit about the team community and development so pixels have, has over nine hundred thousand registered players and an active community the floor price of farmland nfts has reached 0.5 eth uh, with over 15 uh, million in secondary sales volume showing strong demand the game continues to expand with new features like pixel pets nfts guild gameplay and token rewards. Pixels is also migrating from Ethereum to the Ronin blockchain for faster transactions and lower gas fees. I wonder what people will see when Ronin, you know, obviously had a, that, that a, hopefully they bounce back. I, don't, I haven't really checked Ronin ever since that experience kind of scared everyone, but that's a little bit about, you know, Pixels. In conclusion, Pixels Farmland is an innovative NFT collection that provides utility and value to players through engaging farming gameplay and metaverse land ownership. With an experienced team, large player base, and promising roadmap, Pixel is well positioned to be a leading Web3 game. However, the long-term value will be, depend on the team's ability to deliver on their ambitious plans and sustain a thriving in-game economy. You guys could go ahead and check on OpenSea Pro. Uh, the floor right now is 1.25. We talked a little bit about the sales, but uh, you guys could go ahead and check out their um, uh, their Twitter. Discover a new style of gameplay. You could play now at pixels.xyz. You could join the Discord. Obviously, you saw that they are currently on Ronin. And Luca, ne Luca Nets has been following them. Luca Nets is the famous new founder of the Pudgy Penguins that have been making a huge stride in the NFT market over the past couple of months. I actually also did a video in my YouTube channel a couple weeks ago. You guys should definitely check that out. But Pixels does seem like a very interesting cultural gaming revolution. And so, yeah, if you guys found this useful, please let me know. If you have any NFT project or any comments or suggestions that you would like to tell me, please do let me know. And uh, welcome back to Web3 Money, and I will see you tomorrow.